If you want to get started unwrapping UVs in Blender with just basic pelt mapping for a organic surface such as this head here, we, the first thing that we want to do is we want to set our seams. To set our seams, we need to go into edit mode. So we're going to hit tab. On my model here, you can see I'm in vertex select mode and I want to place a seam right up the forehead, down the back of the head, fairly standard like. I'm going to select the bottom vertex here where I want the seam to stop. I'm going to select the base of the, the neck here. Then I'm going to hit W to bring up my specials menu, and I'm going to choose Select Vertex Path. And by default, this will probably be set to edge length, but you can also change it to topological here in the operator panel, which remember you can access this operator panel by pressing F6, and that will select all the edges that I want. I can then simply go over to the toolbar and click Mark Seam, or you can find your seam options by hitting Control E, and you'll find Mark Seam and Clear Seam. Now that I have my seam selected, I can just double tap A first to deselect and then the second time to select everything. And I'm going to hit U to bring in my unwrapping menu and then choose the default unwrap command. If we now, for one, you can see that we've now added a UV map over here underneath the object data buttons. And if we switch over to our UV editing layout, which is simply a UV image editor and a 3D view, you can see we have a very nice clean unwrap with no hassle. So this is the basics of it. We've got obviously more controls than this, but that's how to get up and going with UV unwrapping in a very, very short time. Simply select your edges, set your seam from either the toolbar or by pressing Control E, and then simply hit U and choose Unwrap.